Okay guys, and welcome to my channel. I'm going to be talking about the Demuel emulator today regarding old school fighting games such as CVS2, Guilty Gear, Marvel vs Capcom 2 and every other game that's in the package in the links below. So download that and it's got the information, all the BIOS plugins so you can use your arcade stick. Um, it's got the arcade ROMs as well, they're not the Dreamcast ISOs or PlayStation 2 ISOs etc. They're full arcade ROMs with enabled netplay. So guys that want to get on this feel free to get the download link from in the comments below. Cool, so first I'm just going to be showing you this. Right, so we've got Dreamcast which runs GDIs, uh, ISOs and bin files to run your Dreamcast games. Ju that's just normal Dreamcast games. The importance here is with Naomi, Naomi 2, and Thomas Wave and Model 3. At the moment I'm going to be focusing on Naomi and Naomi 2. Again, you won't need any extra files because all the files will be in the in the zip file which is in the link description and makes it a lot easier for yourself. Cool, so the only down flaw about this is you can't um, you can't filter it for the games that you have. So you just kind of have to have a look at the games that are listed in the zip file and just load up those ones. Now Accent Core, I've not really tried that one. I've tried to have a look for it but it's only got XX Reload and... Oh there we go, Accent Core. Right, so now we can try this one. Let's see what it's like. I've not tried this one to be honest so... Tried CBS 2, it runs like a charm really nicely and Marvel vs Capcom 2 but I'll be getting into that soon. Now this little beauty here enables netplay. You can disable this if you go into config and you can just disable netplay altogether so it won't load up this message whatsoever. Also you can load up master servers list and you will have all of your connections and all waiting games if you click on that little button there. Again, I don't want to do that right now because I'm going over what kind of PC you need to play these games because a lot of you guys won't end up downloading it because you want to think wait a minute my PC is probably not powerful enough so I'll just leave it for them but if you want to check on my specs they'll be in the link below as well so well not even a link it's just description of my GPU, my processor, my RAM and what kind of hard drive I'm running from whether it being SATA free or just normal SATA but I'm not running anything too high spec to be honest cool so Naomi fully emulated by Demule, really cool, cool stuff. Again, you can end up um, equipping like button bindings from your arcade stick to this. Um, you won't be able to see the full screen at the moment because I've only capped a certain proportion of it so I'm just using Windows Capture right now just to show you what it, the speed is running like but yeah but yeah as you can see it runs like a charm kick the best move in the game <laughs> god it's been so long <laughs> but yeah, there's Guilty Gear running, no sound problems, no video errors, arcade stick M import with a Quan Bar Q4, I've got another one here, you can equip two players at the same time, so you can play local multiplayer if you'd like. Now let's get into the other games. Alright, uh, let's just config the, the screen aside just so I can put it in the right proportion so you guys can see properly. Look, there's nothing wrong whatsoever, like, literally the blending, the textures, there's nothing going too bad at all. Everything's running full speed as well. Right, so when you're done with that, just click file and stop. Again, it'll create an error, but slow it back up, and you'll be fine. Right, so next game I want to show you is one of my favourite games of all time, which I love so much, but there's no scene for it, so it's just going to be one of those games in the back of your head this little beauty right here. Again, net play, but we don't want to do any of that right now. You, you can disable that in config menu. 
click X. I'll show you this little view right here. This game has a lot of potential, but it was way ahead of its time. When the fighting game scene was, you know, it had a, a lot of its major players. Like you had um, Justin Wong and Sanford Kelly and all the major heads, but at the time there wasn't as big a scene as there is now for Street Fighter which is why it's ahead of its time. Cool, so obviously A group because that's the most broken group. Now if you don't know about this game, uh, you're missing out. Just click the link below, grab the download, launch it up, go into training mode, because you can go into the service menu on this. You just have to find it with some certain button. Come on, come on. I'll just go for a few of it, a little bit of it. Music on this is so good. change the speed setting as well because I'm not used to this it's, it feels like about three star speed it's supposed to be four star out of five star it's a lot bit faster than just people usually choose the speed so they can do paint the fence with uh, bison if you're not aware of a uh, paint the fence then definitely check it out on YouTube and you'll realize what I mean 90% damage over the daft days of a like A group <laughs> bit of uh, alpha free reference right there. When the AI never blocks, they, they just don't block. Another cheap tactic about this which made the game die really fast, roll cancel. Now rolling, you're invincible for a certain amount of frames, but they can grab you. Now roll cancel, you cancel the roll into a special which gives you the invincibility of the start of it. Man, I missed it. Ain't nobody got time for that. God damn, I wish you'd block a little bit. You guys a little bit of cell. Straight out. Any two people out. But 
press the win button with Sagat. Oops, hard kick. <laughs> Alright, so our next game I'm going to show you now. Again, start, created an error, blah blah blah. Quick load, run, Naomi. You know what game's coming next. Now, I wish I could get back into this, but it's been too long. It really has. There was a time when I just ended up playing this game so much that I gave up in every other game. This little beauty right here. Now this is the arcade ROM as well. It's the most broken version. Well, along with the Dreamcast. The most broken version of Marvelous Capcom, hands down. Guard breaks on the incoming, so broken. Iron Man, Cyclops. Even Cable was good. Gunshot, Tegany, Hyper Viper. <laughs> Sentinel was so good in this. Look at that flight speed. Look at that hyper armor. Oos, oos, oos. One, two, three. Oh. Again, it's been so long. As you can see, it's running nicely. <laughs> Computer's like, I don't know what to do. buffering on the hyper animations. I mean there might be a few graf graphical glitches as you just saw then but nothing that actually occurs in game. Even the background looks nice. Man, this game is so good. 
But yeah, um, that's pretty much all there is to it. Yeah, I mean, as you can see, it runs all the games nicely. Everything's perfect input. There's no lag on the inputs with the arcade stick. It's running the BIOS, plugins, ROM, everything perfectly. I mean, you should all, guys, get onto this. Anybody that's really into old school games. Because there's not just that one game that they offer. There's Guilty Gear, there's CBS2, you got loads of obscure games that I've not really heard of. I mean, if you guys are in, any of you guys are into Rumblefish, I don't really play that that much though. I think that was that girly wrestling game, I'm not too sure. Initial D, Melty Blood, I know there's a lot of Melty Blood uh, fans out there. Project Justice, now that's what we're talking about. Next video I do is doing on that, and I'm going to show you some stupid Roberto combos that do like 70%. <laughs> without using me to and then you had like Roy combos which was stupid because he had infinites um, but yeah as you can see a lot of games right here just download any any of the games that you're really into and you can go on Dreamcast games as well you'd have to load up the actual ISO for this at the moment it's showing this initial D English because that's the default image that I've got saved for the Dreamcast, but you can change that, you just go on to config and GD1. Well, Thomas Wave, that's the old school Guilty Gear, so you got Iska on there, pretend I didn't say that because Iska's terrible. Um, what else have we got? Let's have a quick look. Rumblefish, again, don't really play it. Naomi, I think Naomi and Naomi 2 are probably the best bet for choosing fighting games. Oh, Power Stone and Power Stone 2. Right, yes. Power Stone and Power Stone 2 and also Rival Schools are going to be the next video that I'm going to um, bring out because I've not actually got the ROM, I, ROM ISOs for those. I have to try and find them, the arcade ones. They're quite hard to find, which is why you should definitely click in the description below and get the download link for all these games. Again, the games are listed on the website when you click on the link of what games are included in the package. You won't need anything else. You just download it, set up your buttons and play. Anyone that you want to play, just connect to their IP address. They'll be able to tell you if you go on to runcommand.exe and then type IP config. It will give you your IP address that you can give to another player and play with them straight away. Or you can just go through the app. It's up to you. But yeah, I appreciate you taking the time to watch over this video and I look forward to seeing your subscriptions as well as your comments in the video. Thanks again guys. Cool. Tune in next time. Peace.